Hi there, this is Ranjit and I have this LG L90 which is a mid-range Android phone and I've already done the unboxing and benchmark for this and in this video we'll be doing the gaming review for this LG L90 and we'll start with some casual games and then move on to heavy games. Let's start with the Subway Surfer now and regarding the specs, it's very uh, similar to the Moto G, it sports a quad-core processor based on the Snapdragon 400 chipset that's clocked at 1.2 GHz. And the GPU is the Adreno 305. Regarding RAM, it has 1 gig of RAM. Again, do notice the screen. Uh, it's a very good quality screen. It's a 4.8 inch uh, screen. Uh, though the screen resolution is QHD, not 720p HD like the Moto G. Uh, this LG L90 also does have, uh, you, uh, what do you say, uh, micro SD card slot. And you can uh, move some of the games and apps to the SD card. You can check out my benchmarking video in which I showed you how to do that. I'll have the links for the other videos that I made for this LG L90 uh, in the YouTube show notes. So as you can see it's running this uh, game very well. Let's uh, move out of this. And let's move to uh, Temple Run 2, which is also a very popular game. So this is Temple Run 2 and uh, I won't change the settings. For example, I'll keep it on default settings. That is medium visual quality. So let's play this game. And the speaker is also adequately loud, I would say. I'm not at max. Let me put at max. I'm one below max. Now we are at max volume. And actually, uh, if you've seen my unboxing video, uh, the phone is pretty light for a 4.7-inch uh, uh, screen. And I would say uh, it's very close to uh, the Xperia M2. I've also made uh, videos about Xperia M2. Regarding performance, both are very similar. So as you can see, it is running this one also pretty well. Oops, I died. So let's move to uh, another game now. And uh, we'll also play this casual game. This is called Tennis 3D. It's a very simple game. And this is also free from the Android uh, uh, Play Store. As you can see, the volume is pretty loud. So let me just lower the volume. So as you can see, it runs this one also pretty well, pretty responsive and touch. So let me move out of this one also now. And now let's move to some uh, little bit of heavy games and we'll start this dead trigger. Create a distraction with gunfire. I'll wait for you near my car. So this is dead trigger. We kill zombies in this one. In fact, the speaker volume is pretty loud 
at max we are at max right now let me lower it one bit yeah So as you can see it's playing even this dead trigger to gain uh, pretty well without any issue. So let us also move out of this uh, dead trigger now. So that was dead trigger and now let me just swipe that away also. And now let's move to asphalt 8. So this is asphalt 8 and uh, one thing i have noticed is uh, though we are gaming for about now it's more than uh, 12 minutes the phone is hardly getting any warm uh, and uh, these are the graphic settings uh, by default it's at medium settings so i'll just keep uh, that uh, to the medium settings and i'm using on-screen steering i use the same settings for the xperia m2 also so let's do some gaming and let's start with this iceland level Bring the drift. As you can see, it's handling it without any issues. Let me try the boost now. Looks pretty good to me till now. Not no noticing any lagginess whatsoever. So as you can see it's playing actually very well out of the tunnel now. So it's playing this level very well. Let's also try with uh, one more level and see how it does. So this is the Tokyo level. So again it's running very nice. So as you can see it's running it actually very well. 
there is no lagginess or anything like that or drop frames that I'm noticing so as you can see it is running this uh, asphalt 8 very well in fact So you won't have any problems playing even heavy games like uh, Asphalt 8 on this LG L90. And now it's uh, almost more than 15 minutes since uh, we are gaming. So let me end this and actually uh, uh, there is, I'm feeling a little bit of warmth uh, near the camera portion at the back but it's not uh, like something like hot or something. We look at it, I have a heat gun, so we'll measure the temperature. So let me just get out of this one also. And I have this heat gun, so let's look at the temperature. As you can see, uh, it is going till about 39 degrees Celsius. But on the front of the screen, uh, it's around 35 to 36 cells, degrees Celsius. So uh, even with heavy gaming, yes, uh, it is uh, doing okay and also it's not heating up very much. For example, uh, just about two days ago, I did the gaming review with this uh, Sony Xperia M2 and after gaming, it went up to around 42 degrees Celsius. So relatively, it is cooler than the Xperia M2. I'll also be doing a full in-depth review for this uh, LG L90 very soon. I've, as I've already mentioned, I've already made some other videos on the LG L90. Links for those videos will be in the YouTube show notes. I hope you found this video helpful. Thank you for watching this video. This is Ranjit and I hope to see you in my next video.